Hi guys, welcome back to CoverGirl's YouTube channel. My name is Ryan Potter and today I am super excited to be partnering up with CoverGirl. I'm going to be talking about their new Outlast All Day custom nude shades. And I'm actually wearing one of the shades right now. This one is in the shade... 960. This is like the perfect like mauve nude shade. I'm gonna be going over all of these seven new shades. So before I start showing you guys all the shades and before we hop into the swatches, I just want to give you guys a background on the product. It's honestly such a cool product and I'm all about inclusivity and that's really what these nude lipsticks are all about. They are inclusive of all skin tones. So so literally whatever skin tone you are and whatever shade that you like, if you like that shade, it's gonna look good in your skin tone. These are universally flattering shades. They are transfer proof. They are food proof. They are kiss proof. Nothing. So yeah, that's just a little bit of background on lipsticks. If you guys are curious what the shades are and how they look on my lips, then let's just go ahead and get into it. I'm not going to waste any time, so let's go ahead and hop into it. I'm first going to be going into the shade 900, and this is the lightest of the bunch. Um, so this is in the shade Light Cool. And what's also really cool about these lipsticks is that they all come with a lip primer. So I'm first going to be going in with the lip primer before I apply any lipstick, just to get the best result. And by the way, I don't have anything on my lips right now just a lip primer. I'm going to be going into the shade 900 and show you guys what it looks like on the lip. This looks actually like really really pretty. This isn't a nude that I would typically wear. Like I love a good peachy nude, um, but I feel like it definitely does enhance your lip color already because it looks like pretty similar to my natural lip color, but like it just looks like, it looks good. I don't know, I really like this color and the formula is really, really nice. If you're someone that kind of steers away from liquid lipsticks because you don't like that drying feeling, this is gonna give you that matte look but it's not gonna feel drying because like right now, it doesn't even really feel like I have anything on my lips. This formula also is up to a 24 hour wear which I don't know about you guys, but I would probably not be wearing my lipstick for 24 hours. But if you're in a situation where you need to, like this lipstick is gonna hold up and it's also kiss proof so let me go ahead and give you guys the test. There is nothing. So it is definitely kiss proof. I'm gonna go ahead and wipe this off and show you guys the next shade. Now I'm gonna be going into the shade 910. This is what the color looks like. This one is definitely right up my alley. This is in the shade light warm. It's kind of like more of a peachier tone shade. So I'm just going to pop this on the lips. Okay, so this is the shade 910. This one is probably gonna be my favorite of the bunch just because I love peachy tones. So it takes about like 10 to 15 seconds for it to dry down to a matte finish and to a transfer proof finish. Um, but I love this shade a lot. This is really, really pretty. Okay, now I'm gonna go into the next shade. This shade is 920. Again, I'm going to prime my lips really quick. Ooh, yeah, this is a really pretty one. This one's kind of like a more pinkier, like mauve shade. So this is a shade 920 medium cool on my lips. This one's definitely more of your like cool tone pink mauvey shade. I feel like if you love pink lipsticks, this is just gonna be like your go-to. Like this is such a good pink shade. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you guys how to get some bang for your buck and use one product for multiple things. So this shade, I feel like would look really, really pretty as a blush. So I'm literally just gonna intensify the blush that I got going on. This is literally just gonna turn into a blush that's going to stay in your face for 24 hours. <laughs> Literally all you have to do is apply it over your foundation and you're good to go. This is honestly probably my favorite thing about these products. I love multi-purpose products so if I can have one product and use it for like two or three different things that is an A plus in my book. So um, yeah this is what the shade 920 looks like on my face. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the next shade. Okay so there's four shades left in the collection. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch all four shades really quick for you guys to show you guys the rest of them and then I'm also gonna swatch all of them on my arm just so you guys can see them side by side and just kind of color compare them just so you guys can see what they all look like next to each other.
All right, guys, so those are all seven of the new custom nude shades from CoverGirl. I think, personally, my favorite is still gonna be 910. This one is just like, this is it for me. Like, this is my shade. This is like the perfect peachy matte. Let me know which shade you guys like best in the comment section down below. If you guys are interested in any of the shades that I swatched on my lips today, all the details on where to find them will be in the description box down below. And I don't think I have anything else to say. Thank you guys so much for watching, and thank you to CoverGirl for partnering up with me on this video. And I will see you guys next time.